hello guys and welcome back let's see how can you use pre-upgrade verified tools to capture the management server important details I am going to log into the my management server let me set the expert password let me go to the expert mode now the location of the uh, upgrade tools if you go to the location fwdir bin directory and from there to the upgrade tools and if you do ls if you list you will see what are the tools available space i have right now with my management server okay so i can see i have 50 gig on my var log directory and Yeah, I have installed around more than let's see I have around 26 GB available with the root directory but when I installed my VM that time I have given total around if you see I have given total hard disk space which is 260 GB and with var log I have specified more than 110 so which is I don't see when I have installed the OS maybe the checkpoint fundamentals but for now I think this is okay and we can you know go ahead with the upgrade process the version I have right now it's R80.30 Gaia and build 484 and we are going to upgrade to R81.10 Gaia Now, let me clear the screen. Present directory is update tools. So, first take backup of migrate tools. I mean the backup from the magnet using the magnet tools of the management server using migrate export uh, the syntax is dot 
forward slash migrate if you ls you will see the tools but if you want to see what is the exact same tax uh, you just need to type uh, uh, dot forward slash and the migrate and if you enter uh, right now we have pre update file files migrate let's see if you can uh, just type migrate and you will see the syntax and if you see uh, let me scroll a bit uh, if you see there is a uh, something called uses migrate action option files so under the action you can use export and import right now we want to use export so the syntax will be migrate space export and the location where you want to store your export file so it will be the location which the file store will be where log and the upgrade like which is I'm going to store this directory upgrade directory and the file name now let's let me clear the screen first and let's go to the uh, where log directory from there let's see if you have a migrate sorry the upgrade directory yeah it's present there let me go to there and see what we have there so only the file is present so that is fine so let's see let me go back to the uh, migrate uh, upgrade tools and from there we will run uh, upgrade tools so it's a uh, dot forward slash migrate migrate export and the location where I want to store this so it's a var log upgrade directory and the file name is sms1 underscore export underscore file and let me enter this before performing uh, this action uh, make sure 
your all smart console applications are closed so that the message you're going to get next as well once you run this so let me clear and run the migrate export tool do you want to continue yes so you need to type here a y but if you see if there is mention close all the client of smart management server the this will perform the cp stop like that yes and it started the copying the files so wait for a minute and see once the file is stored into the location so copying required files okay now it's compressing the files okay the operation is completed and the the output is stored at the location we have specified where log upgrade if you can see now using WinSCP you can copy this file to your your PC let me go back and open the WinSCP and from there i am going to copy this before that let me just you know enable the bash uh, prompt for the winscp to run properly without any error so this is the syntax to do that let me open the winscp now ip address is 192 168 1.101 admin is the username and the password let me log in okay I have access now let go to the var log directory and from there upgrade directory there is upgrade from here I can see the file let me go to the desired location of my PC where I want to store this and I'm going to just uh, copy this file from the management server to my PC for the backup purpose So I hope you found this video informative and thanks for watching this video.